The Susan G. Komen Race for the Cure is about honoring those who have passed away from breast cancer, about supporting those in treatment, and about celebrating the survivors. Four years. Last year, 415 survivors signed up for the Hawaii race. Seeing them in their pink hats makes all the hard work worthwhile for race coordinator Nina Rappeling. It just makes you want to cry. Because then they all know that they're not alone. And I think that's a key. And that's what I think um, Cohen offers is hope. And for Rappeline, the hope is what she needed as a breast cancer survivor herself. And I call it the opportunity of, of survivorship. And um, that's, that's what I feel it is. So it's a way to give back for what's been given to me. Who is Susan G. Komen and what is the race for the cure? Well, that's Susan on the right in stripes with her sister Nancy. Susan died from breast cancer and Nancy promised her sister she would do something to help find a cure. So she came up with Susan G. Komen, which was the first breast cancer foundation started in grassroots in her living room with five women. They threw in money into a, a, a as a matter of fact, it's funny because they threw in money in a shoe box. In 27 years, the foundation has raised $1.5 billion for breast cancer education, treatment, and screening. The first Hawaii race was held in 1995. It raised $50,000. Last year, nearly 6,000 people participated in the Hawaii event, raising a half a million dollars, and 75% of that stays right here in the islands. And KITV is proud to be a sponsor of the Komen Race for the Cure. Each week, we'll bring you stories about breast cancer. You hear about the progress and meet the patients, like Dennis and Pam Schuel, who are both battling breast cancer. The breast cancer thing was just a complete utter shock. I was in shock. Uh, when, it, when the doctor told me that that lump on my chest was cancer, I was in shock. It's for the Schuels and the others who have or who have had <laughs> breast cancer that the Komen Hawaii office works so hard. With the race months away, they already have 17 teams signed up. They hope to one day expand the event to three days. But their ultimate goal? Eventually, we hope we put ourselves out of business, that we will find that cure for breast cancer. That's what our ultimate hope is. It's all our hopes that a cure will be found. That's what the Race for the Cure is all about. Remember, each Tuesday night here on KITV4 News at 5, we'll share with you a story about breast cancer, the breakthroughs, the accomplishments, the survivors. For more information on the Komen Race for the Cure, just go to our website at KITV.com.